this our phrase which is murakkab tawsifi so the next point is that um, we said that uh, for correct use of a noun in a sentence we will have to be familiar with four aspects of a noun and we have worked quite hard on that to make our foundation strong um, so what are those four aspects the four aspects are um, arab arab and then we said is wusa which is marifa and nakira which is definiteness then we said jeans will have to be familiar with that whether it's muzakkar or muannis and then adad which is number whether it's wahid, sasnya or jama so we will have to be familiar with these four attributes of a noun for correct use of that noun in a phrase or a sentence so we have kind of made our first phrase which is waladun hasanun a good boy and what do i mean by all this what i mean by all that is that uh, let's start working on it in this case waladun is muzakkar let's start from here it is muzakkar okay um from the jeans point of view from the other point of view it's wahid okay from the wusa point of view it is indefinite which is nakira not marifa and from the arab point of view this is in rafa waladun waladan waladin so waladun is in rafa so rafa so we have these four aspects of a noun and in this case mosuf is muzakkar it's wahid it's nakira and it's in rafa now what happens in murakkab tawsifi is that um, sifa follows mosuf and sifa will have to follow mosuf in all these four aspects if mosuf is muzakkar sifa will have to be muzakkar if mosuf is wahid sifa will have to be wahid if Mosuf is Nakira, Sifa will have to be Nakira. If Mosuf is in Rafa, Sifa will have to be in Rafa. And here, Waladun Hasanun. Hasanun is following Waladun in all these four aspects. Hasanun tallies with Waladun. Hasanun agrees with Waladun in all these four aspects. And this is very important as far as the Murakkab Tosifi is concerned because the Sifa simply have to follow Mosuf. In other words, Sifa doesn't have anything on its own right. Um, Sifa cannot be Muhannas for a Muzakkar Mosuf. It has to be Muzakkar. If Mosuf is in Rafa, Sifa will have to be in Rafa. We cannot say Waladun Hasanan. That will be wrong. Or we cannot say waladun hasanin that will be wrong we cannot say waladun hasanatun that will be more necessary. that will be wrong so waladun hasanun has to follow waladun and has to follow from all these four aspects uh, let us make this uh, dual so now we want to say two good boys any two good boys let's keep it indefinite any two good boys and we are going to say in arabic uh, from waladan it will become waladan waladan two boys and sifa now has to follow mosuf so sifa has to become dual so waladan hasanani hasanani Literally, what we are saying is two boys, two good. But in English, we don't translate that way. We're just going to say two good boys. So, Waladani, Hasanani, two, any two good boys. This is indefinite. Um, let us make this um, plural. Plural of Waladun is um, uh, Jama 
مكسر which is ولد أولاد أولاد so now the موصوف has become plural صفة will have to follow so صفة of حسن plural of حسن is also جمع مكسر which is حسان So, awladun hisanun, some good boys. So what we are saying here is really some boys, some good kind of thing. A translation will be some good boys. So, awladun hisanun. What if we make um, mosuf moannes? So, waladun boy bintun will be girl. been done. So now we want to say good girl. So in English good boy and then good girl. So we we'll see this good remains the same whether it's boy whether it's a girl good girl good boy but in Arabic that is not going to be the case. We cannot say bintun hasanun this hasanun will have to become mu'annas and we know that in sifa we can easily make mu'annas from muzakkar if you remember one of the previous videos in which we discussed two types of um, indefinite nouns uh, and one was ism zat and the other one was ism sifa and there are many others as well but we just addressed two at that time so sifa we can always uh, change to mu'annas by adding marbuta here. In isme zat, most of the time we cannot do that. Sometimes it's possible, but most of the time it isn't. But in isme sifa, we can always make uh, uh, muzakkar into muannas by just adding ta marbuta here. So what we do here is uh, we remove this tanbeen and give it fatha and then add ta marbuta. So bintun hasanatun. Hasanatun. A good girl. Okay, what about two good girls? So that will be kind of um, dual of this. Will be bintani. Bintani. And that will have to become dual as well. So hasanatani. Hasa. Natani. Hasa Natani. So we cannot say Bintani Hasanani. That will be wrong. Bintani is oneness and Hasanatani Sifa will have to follow Mosuf and become oneness as well. The rule of that is again Jama Mukassar, which is Bintun Banatun. Banatun some girls okay and now we want to say some good girl we are keeping this indefinite so banatun and that will be hasanatun hasanatun so here moannas moannas um jama jama uh, rafa rafa and nakira nakira so sifa is going to follow mosuf in all these four aspects in all these four qualities of a noun